<laughs> yo, 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 what's cracking, baby? What's happening out there tonight? We're going to be looking at hole number one with Iceberg. We're going to be going, we're going to be going uh, mid plus 25%. We'll be using, um, Power one ball, navigator, okay, six six, and um, which is seven two on the pool. Now, if you notice right there, this is your spin, three point one or maybe three point two, okay, and then um. Red ring by the rough. It's going to be touching it right there. Now just notice, uh, we want to actually shade that ball guide to the right side. Just a little bit more. It's, uh, yeah, we want, to, we want to shade that just a touch more to the right. Um, so we'll do that next time. Going to be pulling at 7, 2. I'm going to pull the 2 right here. Then I'm going to go all the way across to get the 7. And there's the 7. Perfect shot. And then you'll notice it will finish on the left side of the cup. This is... <clears throat> This is why we want to uh, we want to uh, finish. I'm sorry. Set the uh, ball guide on the left side, and um, let's see here. And then we're going to show another one here. This is going to be ice hole. Pretty sure he has a nine on his. Uh, let's see. Yeah, he's got a nine as well. All right. So same deal. Same setup. I want you to notice this something here. I'm just going to let it play and then we'll go over what happened. So look at that. It's still the same spot. It's shaded to the left side of the cup. Now it's saying it's short. Let's so let's go back. Let's look at, go back and look at the ring pull. So 25% mid, which is 6-1. There's the one. I'm gonna go all the way across to get to the six, which is right there. Okay. All right, so the next thing, 5-6 is the wind, okay? Let's go back and now look at this. Speed of it, right? So that may be more like 3.2 there, 2-5. Um, so it checked it just a little bit, right? So let's uh, go back and look at icebergs. So, has the, a little bit less backspin, and the wind is a little higher. So, um, I think those two things coupled together, lower wind and a little bit more backspin, made it check up, okay? The wind here is 6.6. Six. So, this is the one that actually went in, if you remember. Right there. But notice... See how it's on the left side of that line? So, it's staying pretty true with the ball guide. I mean, just a shade to the left. And you can see where it lands right here. See the shadow? I mean, it's landing on the ball guide. So we know the wind adjustment's pretty good. It's just the wind effect making it leak just a little bit. But, so we need to move that over just a tad, right? Because right there, we see the shadow, and it's right there. Okay. So now let's go back and look at the wind for, um, yeah, so this is 5.6. 
And again, we'll look at the spin. Because I think those two little key factors, it's got a little bit more backspin and the wind's not pushing it as much. So those two things, I think, are affecting it um, from stopping. Now, just where it lands, you know, right? I mean, it's 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 close right there, right? Right to the left of that line. So that's why I'm saying we want to shade to the right side a little bit more um, versus the original setup. So let's uh, let's look at the original line here. Let's see if I zoom in at all right here. Okay, I do. I do. Zoom in. All right, so let's look at that. I mean, it looks like on that one, I am shaded to the right. I think I was prepared for that one, too, because of the last one. And I was like, oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. There it is. I just moved it over. Just moved it over. See it? So we still need to go back to the right side. I was right the first time. Um, anyhow. That is, I think that's going to be the key factor for this hole right here, okay? Um, the wind and the backspin, but you can just see that right there. I moved it, okay? All right, guys, listen, this has been hole number one. I hope you've enjoyed it, but just remember, not too much backspin. You need to get to the hole and uh, shade to the right side at mid was 25%. And uh, we'll watch the hole in one one more time with Iceberg. And um, six, 6 which is 7-2. Power one ball. <clears throat> so if you use a wind ball, um, you know, again, that could slow it down a little bit too. So you get, I mean... We went down a little bit on wind, but, you know, it's going to be something we need to watch. Be careful of your backspin and because uh, the wind will be a lot lower if you use a wind ball, okay? You may not get that push. So be very, very, very careful of that. But as you can see, though, I mean, the speed is what really put that in the hole there because, I mean, that's one of those you could, it could lip out easily if it was going too fast. But, you know, again, line-wise, mid plus 25% looks pretty good. It stayed pretty true to our ball guide there, meaning, you know, we lined up there, pulled the rings, and it was exactly you know, right where we put it. So basically we just need to shade it to the, uh, shade it to the uh, right just a little bit. And uh, I could show you one more where it actually leaked to the left a little bit as well. So that's another reason uh, on another account last night, we le we did leak to the left. And uh, that's, that's something you're going to have to really be conscious of. But <clears throat> that was just enough for it to go in. And <clears throat> let's, I'll tell you what, let's go back and look just so we can, just because we're here, let's really pay attention to our red ring and compare these red rings just to make sure here. All right. Our set points. <clears throat> All right. So that is touching. We are right there. Okay. And again, Left side of the line, and uh, right, let's see, I mean, it stays pretty true on that line, right, so right there's when I'm there, yep, see it, that's it, so we need to be to the right side, so that's staying pretty true there. <clears throat> Let's look at uh, this red ring one more time just to make sure our, all our set points are good. Okay, I'm starting to pull the rings there. So, right, yeah, 
All right, so good. All right, so that's going to be your true set points there. Red ring, all right? And then we're going to really watch the backspin and the wind. All right, guys? Y'all have a great night, and good luck on hole number uh, one of Origin Links. And this is the Iceman with Hot Tip for number one.